Number 31. Bad Hickey Black. There's a boy in my bedroom. There's a boy in my bedroom. Does he need to be fed? Does he need to be watered? Do I offer him tea? Does he want something stronger? Does he want to just chill, watch Netflix and sleep? Does he want to just chill, leave cum on my sleep sheets? <laughs> Has he already douched? Is he expecting a douche? Is the vibrator charged? Is he already loose? Is he calling a dripper? Does he want to go home? Do I want him to stay? Do I want him to go? No. Then why is he not talking? Is it, is it something I said? But I ain't said nothing. Oh, maybe, maybe that's it. So we're sitting in silence. Is it silence to be broken? The rule is to speak if something's said, but only if it's said something that's unspoken. Huh. But what's unspoken? What is left red? Is that a signal? A signal from the boy in the bed? I don't have spare bottoms. What if he's cold? What if he drops dead at 20? 20, oh god, um, 20 something years old? Could I dispose of a body? <laughs> Is he too heavy to lift? Who can I call that has a large truck or other means of transport that can move a body to a disclosed location? What's that stuff? You know, stuff that melts fat? I know it's the fat that will get you. It's the lime. No, it's the lie. I'll melt all their soaps and I'll, I, Christ, I can't go to prison. I wouldn't be any good. I'll tell the pod bosses that he's a Leo and I'll order paprika for my food. <laughs> Oh my god, he's just coughed in his hands. I bet he's got something bad and he'll be sick for weeks. And I'm gonna die by those hands. And I have no annual leave, so I'll lose my shit job and I can't get another because of this fucking prison slog. And without the NHS, I'm just gonna die of the cold and I always thought I'll never grow old and as the angels ascend, they'll find me in the street because I won't have my linen Ikea bed sheets and there's still a boy in my bedroom on my bed, while I'm dying, in the dark, with sickness he spread, and he, 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 actually looks really cute in this light. <laughs> and I wonder if we, oh, we're kissing. <laughs> That's from the pamphlet I'm working on called Sex by Numbers. So eventually it will become a thing. Um, this is just a little something else. Um, it's based on <coughs> Norse mythology. Let your conquest drip from your lapping tongues. Odin, what are you going to do with that one-eyed thing? I gorge in your last sight and feast on man's lust. Fenrir conquers the realms. I will have a last. Ah! You will be my offering. You will nestle in the darkness of my great belly and find comfort in it, feeding my hunger. Gods are but men with too much to say, are they not? Midgard is our dance floor. Your armies will be forfeit to the mouths of my sister, Hattie and Skull. I, Fenrir, will feast on your world and never grow full. We will swallow the light and the shadow. We are creatures of flesh. What magic will save you now? The Bifrost is our flag. Your walls mean nothing to our carnage. In wars you wage, who will stand before our gluttony? Asgard is in my womb, my belly your tomb. Wield your spear, small man, I have teeth longer than you and your arms. And in the new world, when all is laid to bear, maybe we will rest when the sky is empty and our fur is wet with your terror. Two birds in one throne, you sat once. The girls and I will have your empire over brunch. Thank you.